I'm back out here in the woods today doing some digging and uh, it's about 65 out here and I got a really good signal it was under this rock and check it out that's an old padlock man under a quartz rock unbelievable I cleaned it up it's got some writing on it S and C or C and S that is awesome old padlock maybe from the 20s I don't know it could be older than that that's a good sign. We're getting on to something. Is that awesome or what? Huge chimney. I just got a good 80 signal here and check it out. Like a toy gun. Sure is. That's cool. Awesome. Like a Texas Ranger or something. Let's see what it says on it. Smoky. That's nice. Old house foundation. Wow, just walked up on it on top of the hill here. Didn't find much at the plantation. I uh, found a toy gun and I did find a ring, sterling silver ring, a Leah Sophia ring. I gave it back to the owner. It was actually hers. She lost it, but didn't get that on camera. This looks like an awesome place. Well, I'm at a different spot now. Looks like old gold mine was here at one time. Check this out. There's quartz rocks everywhere. Either those are little mine shafts or places where trees rotted away, but I doubt that. Wow, this is weird. It's like somebody dug a big grave. That wasn't long ago either, because these trees aren't that old. With all these white quartz, there has to be gold in the area. That's a great sign, white quartz. It's everywhere around here. It's like that place I found a couple weeks ago where there was mine shafts. I just found the biggest bottle dump. It goes on forever. All the way down through there. Look at that. I've never seen one of these. Let's see what it says. Can't tell, I'll have to clean it up. But this might be a good dump, about 40s and 50s. There's stuff in the ground as well. What is this? It's like a lipstick case. Wow. There's a knee high, broken knee high. I don't think anybody's dug in it either. Oh, broken coke. Look at all the bottles. A little milk of magnesia. Oh man. Now that right there looks older. Variety of stuff in here. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Might keep that one. There's stuff everywhere. They just go on forever. Tons of bottles. Oh, this is a big dump. There's another broken Coke. This one's complete. Look at that. Sure is. Let's see. It's a Pat D. Coke. Chipped on the top there. That's a bummer. I still may keep it though. See if we can find a better one. I'm sure there's more out here. There's bottles all over. the leaves back to look at the bottles and I found this oh some type oh it's like a military medical pen or something wow that is awesome unreal this must have been a dump during the 40s and they threw jackets and stuff in here and they rotted away and the badges are 
just laying on top of the dirt. Wow, it's a great day. I'm pretty sure that's medical. It may not be, but I think that's what it is. Sweet, let's go get some more. Neat little bottle, probably from the 60s. Ooh, that had something on it. Swift's Jewel Oil. That's cool. For salads and all fine cooking. All kinds of neat things in here. I mean, everywhere you walk, you're stepping on a bottle. It goes on for miles. Look at all that. I don't think many people dug in this. Man, this is unreal. Stuff over here ain't as old. Finally found a complete Coke. Pat D, no chips or nothing. I'll keep that one. This is really cool. It says New York World's Fair 1939. Have no idea what it was. Some type of dish thing. A container for something. That would have been nice. Too bad it's broken. Old poison bottle. Mmm. There's stuff everywhere. I mean, every time I walk on it, I break half the things here. So you have to just dig through it with your hands. There's so much awesome stuff on top of the ground. From all ages. And it's just amazing. So there's a Coke bottle there. The broken one there, broken one there, this one chipped right there. There's stuff everywhere. If I dug in here long enough, I'd probably find something rare. This Coke here is a Pat December 25th, 1923, so it's an older one. It almost looks white, too. It's not as green. I managed to find this little bluebird never heard of that it's cool it has a bird on the front and it has a patent date of April 14th 1925 it's pretty cool I'm gonna keep that one look at this beautiful plate that is awesome also found part to a toy car it's missing the wheels old car this is a Amazing place. All kinds of stuff mixed in here, old and new. I think I just found a coin. I was raking back some of the bottles, and right down in the bottom of the hole, it looks like a coin. May just be a wheat penny, or maybe something better. Yeah, I think it's just a wheat penny. Didn't need a detector, though. Yep. I bought it. That's awesome. First marble of the day. It's like a white and brown one. Dark brown. I'll take it. Also dug a spoon. Ooh, look at this. Toothbrush. That's kind of weird. Look at that. Huh. Oh, look, a marble. Awesome. See if there's anything else up here. It's a neat little bottle. I guess it was some type of perfume. I don't know, or cologne. That is awesome. Couldn't fit much in there, could you? Found me another marble. Pretty one, green. All right. I may head on out and explore some more woods. I've kind of got distracted with the bottle dump here and been digging bottles. But I need to try to find some more house sites. I don't want to break his tail off. Little guy, come here boy. Oh, there he is.
about to call it quits for today. I did a lot of digging in this bottle dump area, and uh, it's getting dark. It's about 6.15, so anyway, let's check out my finds. Here's all my finds from the bottle dump. So many milk of magnesias. I guess back then a lot of people had tummy aches. But a lot of collectors like these dark blue bottles. I don't know how much they're worth. Probably a dollar a piece. But I'm not going to take all these home. I'll take a couple. I will take the Cokes. I have one, two, three, four. Four Cokes. There's a broken cheer wine there. And I do have a Dr. Pepper, 10, 2, and 4. It's not a green one, though. Still cool to find. Uh, here's that poison bottle. It was broken, and I found the other piece to it. I'm going to take it home and glue it back together. It'll still make a nice display piece. Found five marbles, that little perfume bottle, I guess, a lipstick case, the wheat pennies from 1946, and this right here, I found one of these last year, and it's kind of funny, I found another one today, it says, Now Lens Direct Applicator or something, copyrighted. Here's that medical collar disc, that's what it looks like. World War II, more than likely. Sweet. Gotta love it. This is a really awesome plate. I'm gonna clean this thing up and and display it. it. Has flower design all the way around it. It's not broken either. I'm surprised. It's right on top of the ground. I just raked the leaves back and saw it. I'm gonna give this one to Abby, this little syrup bottle. She wanted to bottle out of the lot. Little toy gun handle there. And some other odds and ends. Neat little bluebird bottle. It's not blue though. So I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Good luck and happy hunting. Somebody lost their bike. Either that or it got stolen. I have no idea what they would have been doing way out here in the woods. It's kind of hard to ride a bike in all this. I'm on the way back to the truck and check this out. It's like a great water spot. A little murky. But that's probably because we had a bunch of rain the other day. It may clear up. Not sure how deep it is. Probably four or five feet right there, if not deeper. But down there looks shallow. A lot of rapids, though.